Hello, welcome back. I believe we are in. Uh, oh, I'm not that bad off. Uh, yes. What I did here basically was to leg past the zombies and the snorks and spam my medkits. I think I used five uh, while moving from uh, from the gate to this, and maybe a few uh, earlier. So now that we are safely in the underground, I know that if I turn off the machine then this area will be uh, well sort of safe uh, for moving. Let's make a manual save here. Okay and now the thing is that I have not been in the underground with the Oblivion Lost, Oblivion Lost mod, so I have no idea what to expect here. Great job, Mark One. You actually made it to the lab. It is vital that we study the installation in the lab. Try to be activated so we can examine it properly. Listen, the prototype can't protect you from destroying emission forever. I've provided for this. When you get hit by a strong field, the timer will start ticking. As soon as the time runs out, the prototype will stop protecting you. So take care and remember about the timer. The fun part is that I have got no prototype on me. But I guess uh, these level changing uh, things are so scripted that you can't really. Whoa! What you what you do? I know that from the adventures of the others. Uh, I know that they have run uh, through red forest and into the into the prepared uh, level level changer uh, when when they didn't actually know that uh, you have to do something else first. So they just run for it and uh, crossing into Pripyat will uh, will trigger a message that uh, uh, that the scorcher is off and that the well basically everything that you have to turn off is off There. Okay, one of these, uh, one of these ledge is led to a stash at some point, but I don't, I don't think I, I even have that uh, information yet. Oh, I think I do. Something. Oh no, that's the, that's the quest marker.
budge. Well, they did, but only a little. Face me, face me. I think you have this head on backwards. safe side. Always blow up the urinals. I think I also blew up the light. Ugh. First time in this lab. And, uh, let's see if I can show it on the map. Oh, it was on the mini map. Thing is that after, <coughs> oops, after you turn off the uh, machine, the mini map shows you exactly what. You what you're seeing now. Basically it leads you here and the arrow is there. And uh, during my very first uh, time in here I, I sort of uh, missed that there was uh, some more stuff in that uh, other floor. So I came back here and uh, I started stacking bodies so that I could reach this this ladder. Also I started stacking crates and as we advanced then uh, just, just, just see where the crates are actually. some in the room after this one. figured out that uh, you always had flashlight available. I thought it was something uh, that you had to earn, like some upgrade. So I dropped fireballs from here to there in order to bring me some light.
save. Yep, like what they have done to it with the room. Where are the fresh corpses? crates here. These are the crates that I would drag under this, uh, uh, this ladder there. I even managed to stack two crates and reach it. And, uh, and the thing was that uh, whenever I fucked up, uh, then it turned out that um, as you reload a game, uh, the you can't see the boxes anymore, crates. They just sort of vanish. Even. Even up, uh, even more after that, I uh, realized that they they are still there. I just can't see them, but at the moment, that that very first moment, what was that? That very first moment of uh, of dying and reloading and finding uh, that the crates weren't there. I think it uh, deserves to go into the Hall of Fame of the great emotional moments in games. Oh yeah, I believe these were more empty.
I'll save here. In case I screw up some, uh, some entries in there. Attention, critical emissions. Leave the area immediately. have the protection so <laughs> so it sucks <laughs> okay in this case I'll stick to my uh, healthy spam here and I only have one bandage I had more. 
for med kits, I might be able to do it, but... Ah! Let's see then. Oh, those two zombies come from that way. So, technically, I should be able, if I, if I move very smart, I should be able to get at least the first lever off. And back here. Okay, I'm gonna try once more. Also, I should probably. Also, I should probably drop uh, a lot of my extra gear. properties uh, appear to be appear to be useful. It's very primitive uh, side protection as well. Well there's definitely someone in the GSC forums uh, so one from the modding community I believe. But I don't know if, if this is like only a vanilla thing or works uh, in general. Well, ammo is nice, but uh, I don't know, spare medkit or two. Oh, 
Oh, goody, goody, goody. Yep, got it. So much to have to. It's hardly enough to survive. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna pause here and keep looting. Uh, and uh, return soon.